yo guys what is Gooch quality here and welcome to a tutorial video in this video I'm pretty much going to show you guys how to network bridge your PlayStation 4 to your laptop or your laptop to your PlayStation 4 whatever pretty much you're going to be using your laptop as a router pretty much and we're going to use a Ethernet cable to do this all right well first of all this tutorial I don't know if it works for desktops or you know stuff like that I only you like I use the desktop and it didn't work for me I don't know if it'll work for you guys I don't know it might work but I'm just giving you a warning it might not you can use Windows 10 through Vista or Vista through 10 or whatever I don't know if this works for XP and lower but I know it works for Vista and up so the first thing what you want to make sure you do is you want to uh connect to the Wi-Fi or have an internet access on your laptop so yeah make sure you do that and then the next thing you want to do go to the bottom left right click go to control panel and go to network and internet network and sharing center um, change adapter settings all right before I go any further in this tutorial what you're gonna need most importantly is a laptop, ethernet cable, Wi-Fi, and a PS4 of course, because we're trying to connect to the PS4 with our ethernet cable to our laptop. So anyway, we did that, we're here at network connections. Don't worry about Bluetooth network connection. You could just ignore that. That has nothing to do with this. What you're worried about is these two, ethernet and Wi-Fi. So yeah. All right guys, before we switch over to the PlayStation, you wanna take your uh, ethernet cable and you wanna go ahead and plug it in the side of your laptop and plug the other end to the side of your PlayStation. I know I got like a lot of cables and stuff back here. Like it's ridiculous, but hey, it's gonna have to work. And before anybody comment, yes, I'm using a phone cup for my microphone. Why? Because my stand keeps falling and it's not stable enough so i'm gonna have to buy a new stand so yes i know it's ghetto it's just gonna have to work for now all right now the next thing you do you of course plug in your uh cable ethernet cable to your laptop and ps4 it's gonna say ethernet unidentified network and everything so yeah while it's saying that you want to go ahead and bridge them and i do this with my playstation already on I think you could do this with it off too, but just to be on the safe side, you probably want to do it while it's already on. I don't know, but you could experiment if you want. So yeah, you want to go ahead and bridge the connections. Let me just show you guys again. You want to click this. Mine says remove from bridge, but yours should say bridge connections or something like that. It says remove from bridge because I already got them bridge or, or whatever. So yeah, once it says that, it'll say identifying, and then for after a little while, it'll say your connection right here, which is mine, this AT&T thing. So yeah, and at the bottom screen, they let you know that they're bridge. This little icon, where the Wi-Fi icon was at, will turn into like you're connected to a router or whatever. You know, the Ethernet icon or whatever so yeah it should say that internet access and everything if it don't then then that means your playstation is off so yeah when you turn it on this icon should pops up all right guys we are here at the playstation side of things now once you're on your playstation you want to go up go all the way to the right to settings network and you want to go to set up internet connection and you want to use your LAN cable easy and this should it should say this once you connected everything right and stuff so it will just be checking successful successful PlayStation Network sign in successful and stuff so now that you're connected to the internet you see this little blue icon to let you know you're connected you can see your friends online I got 27 friends online that means I'm online you could make parties and yeah you're online so anyway guys so yeah guys that's pretty much it for the tutorial um you got your network bridge your Wi-Fi bridge and everything 
And once you're done connecting and or playing the PlayStation or whatever, you could just simply right click on this and you could click delete and everything. And once you wanna like connect again, just do the same thing over. You're gonna drag on these two and bridge connections so yeah it's as easy as that guys hopefully this helped well anyway guys that's gonna be it for this video comment like subscribe if this helped and if you enjoy you can check out my other videos i do gaming related stuff gameplays and everything so yeah it's pretty fun that's gonna be it for this video and i'll see you guys in the next video peace out